Dollar Swiss Daily Forecast, December 30th, FXEmpire.com. The dollar Swiss pair originally rose during the session on Thursday, uh, as you can see by this candle here, but fell later in the day as the Italians managed to get the auction off on their 10 year bonds. The yields were at just under 7%, but after auction trading in the secondary markets had the yield back, but back over the 7% level again. Because of this, there was originally a run to the US dollar in the first few hours of the Thursday session. However, as the euro didn't completely implode, the dollar was sold back off and it was no different in this pair. The Swiss franc got a bid, probably in covering by traders uh, that had originally gone long for the session as opposed to any real conviction to buy it. The 93 level is marked by the yellow line in this chart. It was the scene of a major breakout recently which was confirmed as support over the last couple days. The level will more than likely hold support again as it is the scene of serious strength by all accounts. The thin markets probably exacerbated and exaggerated all moves in all direction and the sell-off is more than likely going to be nothing of consequence. The 93 level will more than likely attract buyers going forward who have missed the initial upsurge. The franc is being actively worked against by the Swiss National Bank and as a result it isn't a favorite currency for traders to hold. The US dollar is currently enjoying both a stronger US economy in relation to other economies and the safe haven status which it normally holds. With both of these factors working for the dollar, it is hard to sell it at the particular moment as there's far too many headline risk out there. Also the franc in particular isn't appealing, so the grind higher makes sense in this pair. Switzerland also has the unfortunate liability of sending 80% of its exports into the European Union, which will be entering recession if it isn't already in one. This in combination with a strong franc is going to hurt the Swiss economy going forward as well. Because of this, the franc is far more than likely to be overvalued at this point, and we are going to continue to buy dips going forward, understanding that it's probably a slow grind up as opposed to a sprint.